This is Miss Nichols, your backyard biologist, and today we'll be making bird seed cakes. You're going to dissolve your Knox gelatin in a quarter cup of cold water. Make sure it's cold water because otherwise it won't dissolve. It'll just be a big chunky piece. Mix well. Then add a quarter cup of hot water. Mix this thoroughly. Then you're going to add three tablespoons of honey or corn syrup. Again, mix this thoroughly so it's completely dissolved. You're going to need three cups of bird seed. Any kind will do. You're going to add three quarters of a cup of flour, half a cup of nuts. Any kind will do. A half a cup of raisins or cranberries. You're going to want to mix this thoroughly. You're then going to add your liquid ingredients and it gets really sticky and gooey. You're then going to place the mixture into four different cups. Make sure you pack them really well. You want to poke a hole all the way down through to the bottom for your string to go through. Allow them to dry overnight. The next day, you want to remove them from the containers. They may need more drying time, but if they're totally dry, insert a string through the hole. Tie a stick to the end of the string. Any knot will do, it doesn't matter, as long as it's sturdy and stays tight. Pull the string back through the hole. Tie a loop on the end to hang on a tree branch. Now hang your feeder outside and wait for the happy customers. This is Miss Nichols, your backyard biologist. Ooh, a bee. Take time and get outside. Hey, buddy.